Hello, I'm Varsha Narmit, and I'm a Web3 Blockchain Specialist Solutions Architect here at AWS. Today, in this video, I'll be showing you how to use Amazon Managed Blockchain Query to discover tokens minted by a smart contract. I will be using the List Token Balances API and pass in a contract address, specifically that of an NFT collection, to discover NFTs. So let's dive in. Let's first start off by talking about Amazon Managed Blockchain, or AMB Query. So Amazon Managed Blockchain, or AMB Query, provides serverless access to standardized multi-blockchain datasets with developer-friendly APIs. You can use AMB Query to more quickly ship applications that require data from one or more public blockchains without the overhead of parsing blockchain data tracing smart contracts, and maintaining specialized indexing infrastructure. Whether you're analyzing historical token balances for fungible tokens or non-fungible tokens, NFTs, viewing the transaction history for a given wallet address, or performing data analytics on the distribution of native cryptocurrencies like Ether, AMB Query makes the blockchain data accessible. At this point, I'll explain to you AMB Query's List Token Balances API and what it does. To start off with, you can see what the request syntax looks like and the response syntax looks like. And what the List Token Balances API allows us to do is it allows us to list all token balances owned by an address, either a contract address or a wallet address. It allows us to list all token balances for all tokens created by a contract, and it also lists all token balances for a given token. So what we'll be doing today is I'll have a small snippet of Python code where I'll be calling the list token balances API, and we'll see a list of NFTs in our collection. But before we do that, I want to quickly go over the prerequisites so that you can follow along as well. To start off with, you need to install Python. You need to install the AWS SDK for Python, which is Boto3. You will also have to install the AWS command line interface or CLI. And lastly, you'll also have to configure your AWS credentials correctly. This Python example uses modules from Boto3 to send requests to Amazon Managed Blockchain or AMB Queries List Token Balances API. In this example, we're retrieving information about the NFTs from the Board Ape Yacht Club collection, which is on the Ethereum mainnet, as you can see there. After you have created a managed blockchain resource, you can specify the API as we did here with the list token balances API, to call and pass in the relevant parameters. In this case, the network, which is the Ethereum mainnet, and the contract address. Below where I call the list token balances API, I have a simple for loop where I display information about each NFT in a digestible visual format. At this point, I will just run this Python code snippet. This run does not show every NFT, but as you can see here, it displays the owner address, the token network, contract address, token ID, balance, blockchain instant time, and last updated time for each of these NFTs displayed here. Before we wrap up, I would like to go over what I mean by blockchain instant time and last updated time from the output I showed previously. As you can see here, the blockchain instant time is the time when the balance of the token was last requested or the current time if the token balance was never requested, while the last updated time is the time when the balance for the token was last updated. At this point, I'd like to quickly summarize what we went over today. We talked about Amazon Managed Blockchain Query, or AMB Query. After that, we talked about the List Token Balances API, what the 
request and response would look like and what this API does. And then we went over a small code snippet, Python code snippet, where we were able to discover tokens minted by the Board Ape NFT collection smart contract. Thank you for joining me to learn how to use Amazon Manage blockchain query to discover tokens minted by smart contracts. That'll be all for today. If you're interested to learn more about Amazon Manage blockchain query, please refer to the links below. Happy development!